hi, I am Murli Mohan and I take care of uh, the operations of IBR Institute of International Business Relations from Germany. IBR is a management institution that has come in from Steinbeis University, Germany into India a couple of years back. We started about two years back to be precise. The whole objective of IBR to come to India is basically to provide quality education for the executives and to help them transform from middle managers to senior managers in the most effective way today that is possible. What is the key feature for IBR uh, that comes from Steinbeis University Germany is that it has a faculty which is from global, it has faculty with lot of experience from various key institutions like Stanford, Harvard, INSEAD France or you name the institution we have the faculty that comes on board of IBR. The key core difference between the management schools that are operating today across the globe and IBR is the fact that not many institutions are to be, I mean I would be, I wouldn't be uh, too much when I say that most of the institutions are only following the pattern of doing something through the books, writing the exams and getting an MBA or getting any degree that we have. Today we have a fundamental issue, the issue is not about what are the number of marks that we are going to get before we pass out an exam. The issue is about how we provide quality, how we provide value and how this whole investment that a student makes for two years in an MBA program is going to help him achieve his goals in his career in the time to come. IBR comes with a difference. There is absolutely very little importance given to studies. Most of the importance or emphasis is based on how well you practice management in your day to day work. So that which means that the number of assignments or the projects that we give are primarily practice based. Each one works as a small project by in itself and every executive who is on board of IBR who is doing his MBA from IBR will have to work, implement that in his organization and see how the whole thing is working for him in the organization. So it cuts two ways. It helps the executive, at the same time it also helps the organization that he is working in. So there is a win-win situation for the organization as well as the executive. Well, when I say that you know there is a project that every executive has to do, here most of our institutions are focused on simply providing some reading material, giving them some subjects to study and read and nothing in terms of the industry interface is provided. Most of the faculty transfers some data that is available on the internet today, there is a lot of information available on Google, we just do a Google search, keyword search download, cut, paste and then see that we are through with our exam and then we get our marks and get a degree. But that is not going to help here. When we are talking about managers, are they really learning something out of this MBA? Are we offering something which is actually practiced in the industry? Are we offering something which these guys can pick up and effectively use in their day to day management in their organization? This is the key that IBR works for. IBR has got uh, international faculty as I said. We also have many, many important initiatives that we have taken up to see that the executives get wonderful experience having come to IBR. Now, we only have about 20 uh, students per batch, which means, which means that, you know, you can uh, see the quality of education that comes when we have only 20 students in batch. We do not take more than 20 students in batch because the faculty which is teaching IBR are all international, they cannot handle more than 20 students per batch because the time that they will have to give to each student is enormous. The kind of work that they do, the kind of uh, review that they do, the kind of analysis that they would like to get back to the students of IBR is something phenomenal. So that is where they, do, they can't take more than 20 students per batch. So with giving all this experience, I would definitely take pride in saying that any executive who is coming into IBR to pursue his higher education of management would be a lot more better person in terms of knowledge, in terms of experience, in terms of understanding what the global practices are in business management compared to any other institute that he can think of to go. While I say this, I am not demeaning that you know the MBA institutions are not providing the right kind of education, but yes, all of us together on this education platform should definitely provide something which is of more value to the students, it is of more value to the managers, be it at the graduate level or be it at the management level. They should be able to get that value ultimately to see that they become better managers, they become better individuals and they also become better professionals to improve this country, to improve this globe. Thank you.